In a world that's drastically changed due to the COVID crisis, many of us will be making changes to our holiday traditions. And new this morning, Nikki Johnson met with a registered dietitian who says it's possible to keep some traditions alive. Good morning, Nikki. Good morning, Josh. Yeah, I talked to a local dietitian about how to have a healthy holiday this year. But what's Thanksgiving if you're not with your family? And can it still be special? Rachel Iverson tells me yes. She says this year there may be supply chain shortages and some of your favorite things might not be around. But when it comes to healthy holiday eating, she recommends not worrying about it this year. Don't stress too much about what you eat or how much you eat. She recommends just taking the day to enjoy what is around you. Be thankful and enjoy what we can, especially when things seem so negative right now. Choose two to three meals that are important to your family gatherings of 10 people or less instead of the normal feast. When we think about memories, sensory information is one of the best ways to recall memories. So smell and taste are going to be really important for that. I love how Rachel took something that could be seen as negative and turned it into a positive. Eat the stuffing, make lasting memories with who you can. And Josh, coming up at 6-11, I'll have Rachel Iverson in studio, and we're going to show you some fun things that we can make with the kids during Thanksgiving, so stay tuned for that. Yeah, I think sometimes when you just want to eat whatever it is, it might be a cake or stuffing, (laughs) just got to eat it. Yeah, stuffing sounds great. Yeah. All right, thanks, Nikki. Looking forward to that.